What is up YouTube? Crazy thing. So this is just a quick video. Season 19 in Axie Infinity has been extended, which why you may ask? Because there's freaking cheaters in Axie Infinity. That's what today's video is about. It's going to be very brief, but listen to this. So some of you guys might be wondering, why is this bad? Of course, cheating in any game is pretty much bad, but at the same time, why is this specifically bad for Axie Infinity and the future of Axie Infinity? So number one, people are most likely going to be worried about the integrity of Axie Infinity, the long-term kind of projection of SLP, of Axie Infinity in general. Any game that has cheaters is always a hurdle for the developers to tackle and to get rid of as soon as possible because obviously if people are, if you're considering it's a competitive game, the way that Axie is right now is that there's so much weight on the competitive PvP aspect and when you take into the fact that there's cheaters out there that are making it even harder for people to get MMR, to get their daily done, to make money basically, after spending money, whether they're a manager or a scholar themselves, it's a very bad mix of just things that they don't want to happen. Um, recently as well, there has been a decrease in daily active users for Axie Infinity, which is to be expected. It's not going to always grow and increase, you know, every single month, even though we've had amazing, there's been amazing gains uh, for the past how many months, right? But now that there's news of cheaters, I feel like this is a crunch time for the developers and Mavis Hub and everybody a part of this project because people that are investing their real hard earned money into the game do not want to risk the fact or risk their investment by playing against cheaters. Now they did mention that they would go ahead and punish those cheaters, but they didn't really get into detail. Are they banned? Are the Axies banned? You know, what are they going to do? And what's going to happen with the future as far as future cheats go? How do we now know if we are playing against a person who's not cheating? You know, they did say it was a very small percentage, but we don't really know. So as a manager and player myself, it is a big question mark for me. And this is something crucial that they'll have to fix and address, hopefully as the days, weeks, and months go by, because this is not very good for the game especially in consideration that they're trying to put a lot more weight on pvp as well as the esports and you know with cheats like this now there's pretty much cheats in every single game i feel like but when you're considering nft games play to earn games cheating is something that you definitely want to handle and at this point who knows maybe they're going to have just manual searching for it an anti-cheat system but Right now, this is uh, pretty spicy news, and at the same time, with it extending Season 19, I think that is a good thing because hopefully they caught all the people using the cheats and it'll give the true players, the, the people that aren't cheating, the opportunity to rank up and get to the proper MMR, but I hope also they ban those cheaters and they got rid of those axes or whatever because, again, this is a huge, huge... Um, just concern and I know a lot of players and investors are gonna feel like this as well so hopefully we don't keep seeing this happen and hopefully it's taken care of the right way but I just wanted to get this video out to let you guys know that that is why season 19 is extending because not everyone sees all these announcements and kind of just to keep an eye on it because you know, if you're feeling like you're in a game, you're in an arena match, and it's someone's a little bit too good at predicting your cards or predicting your plays, maybe go back, review it, maybe throw a report out. I don't know if that's really going to help, but again, hopefully we just can expect the Sky Mavis team and the rest of the community from Axie Infinity to handle this because that's what we need as players, as investors, and uh, I don't really have the answer, but... Yeah, hopefully it gets taken care of, man. And I know a lot of people, by the way, I know a lot of people too are, are saying, you know, that's why they dropped from 1600, 1600 MMR to, you know, 800 MMR. But 
Do we know if that's the case or not? Not really. There's still a lot of people misplaying. But anyway, uh, that's pretty much it, man. Thank you guys for enjoying this video. Please do give it a comment. Let me know what you guys think about this whole cheating situation in Axie Infinity. And if it's going to affect your choice to stay in it, stay in it as a player, stay in it as a manager, an investor. Um, for me personally, I'm still going to keep playing Axie, still keep following the project because I still am optimistic and bullish on it. But this is a huge thing. This is a huge deal, definitely. And I hope it gets taken care of uh, in the best way possible. All right. So let me know what you guys think. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.